Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome to Webventure TV. If you wanna know how to challenge yourself physically and even mentally, then please don't go anywhere because I and my co-host Thor are gonna lend you some insight and inspiration today and it all starts right now. If you don't know me already, I'm Clark, the host and creator here at Webventure TV, where we like to focus on becoming the best versions of ourselves becoming who we are meant to be. And what that means for us is that we talk about being fit, strong, and healthy in both mind, body, and spirit. Now, if that's something that interests you, if that's something that you want to know more about, we would love it if you joined the tribe. And all you have to do is hit the subscribe button. And it's right down there in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. And then slide that little hand to the, uh, the notification bell. It looks just like that so that you don't miss any of the episodes, which we release twice a week on Tuesday afternoons and Saturday mornings. In today's episode, we're gonna talk about how to challenge yourself physically and honestly, challenging yourself even mentally because the two are sometimes synonymous. This can be part of your fitness journey. This can be part of your health and wellness journey. This can be part of a mental or spiritual journey. It applies to everything. In terms of fitness stuff today though, Thor has a great quad guardian kick and workout for you. So don't go anywhere so that you can make sure that you see all the movements and modifications and the workout that he has in store for us. And here are my two cents in 60 seconds on the topic. To challenge ourselves physically and even mentally, we have to get comfortable being uncomfortable. And that means we have to face our fears. We have to do things that we don't wanna do. We have to do things that we never thought we were capable of doing. We have to do the things and the hard work that nobody else does. And that means a lot of discomfort sometimes, a lot of pain, a lot of suffering, both physically, mentally, and even spiritually. But it is so worth it because challenging ourselves while it's not fun is rewarding. The strength, the resolve, the resilience that comes from that experience of challenging ourselves, they are immeasurable. The benefits of it are invaluable, my friends. So there you go. Challenging ourselves physically and even mentally means getting comfortable being uncomfortable. All right, think about that. But for the time being, let's pass the hammer to Thor and see what he has to say on the matter. Take it away, Thor. <laughs> Huzzah, Clark. It is a blessing to see thee, my friend. Well, I mean, should I say, to hear thee, my friend, and to be in thy presence. <laughs> Thor, wh what's going on? Not Why are you wearing a blindfold? Sure. Not quite sure where you are, but, um, well, Clark, I'm challenging myself to do everything blindfolded so that I can learn to rely on my other senses. For instance, Oh, what is that a faint sulfuric smell like rotten eggs or a decomposing goat? Ugh. Did someone pass gas? What's that's disgusting. Why why would we do that? Okay, I, I love that you're taking this topic in this episode really seriously and that you're challenging yourself to do something uh, out of the norm for you, but maybe just for the purpose of the episode, you should take the blindfold off just to be able to better convey to uh, our listeners uh, your thoughts on, on the matter. What do you think? Well, yes, I suppose you're right, Clark. I shall take off my blindfold and ah, ah, there you are, my friends. Huzzah, it is fine to see thee. <laughs> Never fear, Clark. I will take it from here and... Clark, from next time, remember what they say. He who smelt it, dealt it. Ah, so keep that in mind next time you pass gas during an episode, yes? <laughs> but I, I didn't, I didn't, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> All joking aside, huzzah, my friends, it is a blessing to see thee again. It is I, Thor Webinson, the not-so-distant cousin of Thor Odinson, you know, the god of, of lightning and thunder with the big hammer in the Avenger movies, yes. It is I, his cousin, the god of soft winds and rains. I will not lead you astray in your quest to become a superhero of your own making. I, Thor Webinson, will be here for you all the way, yes. <laughs> So you want to challenge yourself physically, yes? You want to surpass the mere immortal life you have been given, mm -hmm, per se? Yes, well, I, I like where you're going with this. Listen now with the tips I have to offer you, the movements, the modifications, and of course, at the very end, the quad guardian kicking workout I have in store. So don't leave. Listen to everything I want to bestow upon you, and you too shall challenge yourself physically. Let us begin right now. Step one, my friends, go a little bit further than you think you can. Perhaps you're just starting out and you can't pick something up, well, try at least. Next time, you're able to pick it up and then you can go a step further. And then my friends, with each and every try, your confidence will gain. And before you know it, you are surpassing the previous attempts because now you know you can and you will always go a little bit further, yes. Step two, my friends, practice what you are not good at. I know it's frustrating, but we have to do things we're not good at to get better. Practice does not make perfect, my friends, but practice, like I said, does make 
better. If you avoid doing something because it is too hard or frustrates you, you'll never be able to do it. It's quite simple. But if you at least try and keep trying, your body and mind will adapt and you will succeed. Try and try again, my friends, and challenge yourself not to give up. Step three, my friends, is mind over matter. Yes, your mind may tell you that you can't do something when you actually can. For instance, this. Don't be afraid to start small, to gain confidence. And once you have succeeded, your mind and body will begin to trust each other, allowing you to succeed further each and every time following that first baby step, yes? No matter if it's jumping, swimming, or throwing hammers, whatever the task at hand may be, mind over matter will erase fears and you will no longer doubt yourself. And next thing you know, you'll be jumping as high as the gods themselves. Yes! Ha ha ha! And now, my friends, it is time for the quad guardian kicking workout I've had in store for you all along. Yes, it is four sets and each set is four minutes in length. So in essence, it's a 16 minute, four minute Emon. That's very confusing, my mind is blown right now. But in essence, it looks like this. Each four minute step starts off with 15 burpees. Here's your modifications. Ten walk-through lunges per leg. A walk-through lunge is a reverse lunge, followed by a forward lunge, and that's considered one rep. Ten on one side, and then ten on the other. And then to fill out the rest of the four minutes, do max jumping squats. As many as you can, only allowing yourself ten to fifteen seconds of rest for the next set of four minutes. So again, every four minutes, for sixteen minutes, four sets each set being four minutes, that triplet. Oh yes, a quad guardian kick in good time. Oh yes. And that's it for now, my friends. Enjoy the workout, enjoy the movements, enjoy the modification, and remember, mind over matter. Push yourself physically, push yourself mentally, and you will never be able to doubt what you are able to do. And you will become a superhero of your own making in no time. Yes. Huzzah, my friends, till next time. <laughs> Well, there you have it, my friends. Like we said, a quad guardian kick-in workout from Thor Webinson himself. I really hope that you enjoyed those movements and all the modifications so that no matter where you are on your fitness journey, you can uh, do a little bit of what he has to offer. And the last little tidbit that I want to recommend to y'all is that you check out this book by David Goggins called you Can't Hurt Me. This has so much to do with being challenged physically and mentally. This guy's story is unbelievable. Um, I will put the link in the comments so that you can purchase it. The audiobook is amazing because it's kind of like a podcast uh, audiobook, uh, but he knows all about getting comfortable being uncomfortable. Uh, I gain nothing from you buying this book. Uh, it's simply something that inspired me and I want to hand it over to you. So check it out, all right? If you learned something new today, please hit that like button, leave a comment, let us know your thoughts on the topic at hand, let us know what challenging yourself physically or mentally means to you, and of course leave comments about what you'd like to discuss in general because your feedback helps us evolve as a channel and make these episodes about topics that are going to help impact you and make your life better. And of course, please hit that subscribe button. Again, it's right down there in the bottom right hand corner of the screen, and then hit that notification bell. That way, you don't miss any episodes. And until the next episode, remember what we always say, be authentic, be fearless, be you. Everything else falls into place. Thanks so much. Talk to you soon. Bye.